You change your diet for the better, you exercise regularly, you've lost weight, and you don't want to gain it back. Now what? Okay, well, good job. There you go. 40 pounds gone. You're going to look great for your son's wedding. Well, then now what? Now what is right? Christy Nickel, nutritionist and author of The Code Red Revolution, says there are three things you need to do once you shed those pounds. For starters, the work doesn't stop with your goals. You still have to adhere to the rules, which means you still have to stay on that scale every day so that you are aware of whatever's going on with your body. You can't ignore what's happening, okay? The scale is the first line of defense. And don't worry if the numbers on the scales fluctuate. It's probably just water weight, but... You still have to drink your water every day because you've got to be properly hydrated for the rest of your life. Just for good overall health, you need to keep drinking your water. Plus, H2O helps stop the dreaded sugar cravings. When you stay properly hydrated, you can make good proper decisions. Next, you gotta know your emotional triggers. A big chunk of what I spend my time on with Code Red is the mental aspect of weight loss. What's causing you to walk like a zombie into the kitchen, open up that fridge, and binge eat? For example, one of my triggers is taxes. I get to a 10 out of 10 stress levels. Once you know your triggers, you can ask for help by having someone you trust hold you accountable to avoid unhealthy habits. And that way you don't keep repeating that cycle. Finally, if you lost some weight and want to keep it off, remember it's a lifestyle, not a diet. The thing you need to remember, the thing you need to wrap your head around is you ain't never going back to your old rules. People typically think of a diet as a fix to a temporary problem that'll be over soon and they can go back to eating what they want. If you're just drinking three shakes a day until you lose that weight before your wedding, yeah, when you go back to real food, it's going to come back on. The lifestyle change comes when you toss the word temporary into the garbage. Once they understand the nature of the trap, they don't want to repeat those behaviors because they realize that that's what's causing the problems. Change your mind, change your body, change your life.